Good morning, I'm Melissa. You're watching Florida on a Dime. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know you're listening. Today is Wednesday, and I am headed to Salvation Army 50% off day. Haven't been in a couple weeks. Um, I've said before, the Salvation Armies don't restock so very often. So I don't find myself there every single Wednesday because I'm just running into the same stuff over and over again. So we're gonna give it a try today. Um, usually I can pick up some nice items. Then um, I haven't decided if I am going to head to the bins or to the new um, the new thrift store that I found uh, to see if their colors for the week have changed. Um, the two times that I've been so far, the colors, the sale colors were the same. So um, now that's a new week, I want to see if they've changed at all. So I might, depending on my time, I'm going to go to Salvation Army, might go to that thrift, and maybe the bins. But um, I still have two buckets of stuff to list. Uh, I just haven't been listing. Uh, maybe 20, 20 items at night and that's about it. So, um, I really don't need the bin right now. Um, I could be looking for more items that are gonna go for more money. So, that's what the plan is today. I just got my oil changed in my car and I'm out and about. And um, yeah, I haven't been around the past couple days because Ian, my 12 year old son, came down with a really nasty case of bronchitis. So I've been babying him, had to get him to the doctor. Um, but he thankfully is back to school today. So I have him all in school again and out and about I go. Well, the Salvation Army used to always open at 9, so I, so I pulled up at 9.08 and there were people still waiting outside. I was like, wow, they're running late on opening the doors. So then it gets to be like 9.20 and I was like, what's going on? So I looked it up. They don't open until 10 o'clock now. I don't know when that changed, but still, 10 o'clock? That's crazy. So I'm headed over to the other because it's literally, literally um like a quarter of a mile away to the other one on the same road uh to the new one that i found so i'm gonna head over there and see if they're open yet well boo um i walked in and was excited to see three new colors on the board and then i read right above it senior citizen day so only seniors got that 50 percent off discount there were no discounts at all for us non-seniors so i didn't even look I'm gonna head back to the Salvation Army now. I didn't realize first thing at Salvation Army was such a big deal. Well, that was pretty much a bust. Um, I got a couple things, not much. Um, about four Victoria's Secret bras, all about a dollar each. So those should bring back a little bit of uh, profit. A sweater that looks like it's good and a North Face sweater. It's not one of their most normal. I have to look it up and see what kind it is because it's very different than most North Faces that I've seen, but it's starting to get out of the season, so I really need to start buying less of those heavy sweaters. But it was only $1.50, so I grabbed it. Um, yeah, my total for like 12 things was like $13, so um, nothing real spectacular. So I'm starting to feel a little defeated today, which means I am headed to the bins. Um, any nurses that watch my uh, channel, I know it's kind of like it's a little personal in there, but um, my kidneys are still bothering me. I've been through um, two antibiotic IV doses, a week of um, heavy antibiotics, and still is a problem. And um, the negative part is that this week, um, I, it, I just know with my history that if I go back to urgent care that they're gonna send me to the ER again. And this week is the worst week to be sent to the ER because I just don't have time for this. 
um, my grandmother's out of town, who is the only one that could really help me during the day to pick up and drop off kids. Um, and, you know, her being out of town has also put a lot more responsibilities on me this week, which I'm fine with. And I'm grateful that she um, makes such a difference in my life when she's here. Um, and I'm so grateful that she's getting this nice vacation with her sister in Tampa. Um, she comes back tomorrow. But I just don't know what to do at this point. I don't know um, who can help, what can help. Um, but it's making me just tired all the time. It's making me, um, I, I just can't get stuff done. Um, I'm, my heart isn't into sourcing. I haven't even sourced, you know, this is the first time this week I'm sourcing. And I just don't, I, I don't know at this point. So, I mean, I, like I said, I'm headed to the bins. Who knows how long I'm gonna be able to stay there. Um, I might walk in and just be like, I can't do this and walk out. But it's where I'm headed to right now. I think I'm gonna get a Coke first. Actually, let me get over so I can get a Coke first. And head on my way there. It's 10.55 in the morning. It's such a weird time for McDonald's to be so darn backed up in the drive-thru. Well, that's it. That's all I got at the bins. I found that off. My game is off today. What the heck? <sighs> well, I still have 45 minutes until I have to go pick up my son from school or at least get him to the pickup line. So I guess I'm headed to Goodwill, which regular Goodwill. Um, I haven't been there in a while. So that's where I'm headed to next. Well, I guess today's lack of finds, as to say, um, is just a message to myself to get listed what I already have in buckets at home. It's either that or just didn't feel well enough to do it or didn't have my heart set into it today. I don't know. I will, however, do a haul when we get home of my very few items that I found today. And I will also show you what has sold in the past couple days. So I will check back later. So while I'm sitting here waiting for my son to get out of school, I thought I would go ahead and show you what has been selling the past couple of days. So here you go. Yeah, things are selling. They really are. I'm very grateful that I'm still making money even though I'm not putting as much work into it as I should be right now. Um, as for the rest of the week, I don't know what's going to happen. I really don't. The girls have their pageant on Saturday and we are spending the night down there Friday night which because um, it's about an hour away down in Fort Lauderdale. And they have to be there from 6 until 9 or 10 Friday night. And then they have to be back there by 7.30 the next morning. So we figured instead of going back and forth, back and forth, we just rented a hotel room down there. Non-refundable. And it's not cheap. Like in Orlando, we can get cheap hotels that are decent. Down here, <sighs> hotels are expensive. So um, I'm trying to... That, that's where I'm just chugging along here trying to get to this pageant get it over with and then I can concentrate on me and until then I'm not sure what's gonna happen with eBay um, hopefully I'll get some stuff listed I don't know I mean I know I have shipping to do I've got 20 things to ship tonight so enough of me complaining I'm not a complainer I'm really not I'm a glass half filled kind of girl right is that right yeah anyway so I will do my haul later all right guys it has been a crazy crazy evening 
So, I have finally gone through my stuff. I can sit down, I can do a haul. Like I said, not much stuff. So we'll start where I started this morning, which was Salvation Army. And here's the few things that I got half off. This is the North Face I was talking about. It's really cool, it zips up and then it has these front little buttons. And then it has a hood. So it's like a hoodie, but I don't, I've never seen this with the buttons in front before. So ladies. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, and that was $2.50. Yes, $2.50. Um, green tags were $0.99, cents and half of that, so I paid $0.50 cents for this, this little Nike skirt. This brand I looked up, it seems to do well, Habitat, clothing to live by. So it's just a purple knit sweater, and I paid $2.50 for this. And these, the only other things I got were the bras, and they're all Victoria's Secrets. There's this one. It was a dollar. And then there's this one. This one I paid more for. This one was $2.50, but it's beautiful. And my daughter actually might try to steal it from me. And this one. And this one's a strapless one. Pink. My um, oldest might try to steal that one from me, which is fine. You know, Victoria's Secret bras were for cheap. Yes. Okay, and then I went to the bins. Um, we pay $1.99 a pound at our bins. I got five pounds. That's it. Okay, this is Victoria's Secret. And it's a little teddy. Sheer. Um... These are really cool. They're Nike dry fit. And they're just, they're athletic pants, which are cool. But I've never seen this before. Does anyone know what this is for? This is the back, like behind the knee. They tie up. I'm not sure what their function is exactly. I'll have to look it up. This is a Bowden denim skirt. Very, very cute. Um, this is a plus size L.L. Bean sweater. I don't usually pick up L.L. Bean, but if it's plus size, and I looked up the comps, and it's a nice spring plus size sweater. And this is, this is the first thing I found when I walked in. It's a Vince silk blouse. Um, this is Delita by Anthropology. It's just a navy top with ruffles. Uh, I recently saw somebody, I can't remember who it was, was selling these athletic jackets called BCG, and this one's a 3X, and it weighs next to nothing, so it was a really nice find. It's a men's jacket. And finally, I got this, um, haven't been buying a lot of bread and butter, like loft and stuff, but I just really liked this blouse, and it was lightweight, and just everything about it was really sweet and dainty and I took it all home in this Vera Bradley reusable bag these are lightweight um they're usually only I think like retail they're maybe eight dollars um I usually get them for about three dollars at the outlet I probably have about five or six of them but you know what I brought home another one today I like this one it says uh Shell, we go to the ocean because everything shells. That's too bad. Just add it to my collection. And then finally is regular Goodwill. Everything I got was half off, thankfully, so everything was $2. The last thing I'm going to show you is actually a dress, but they considered it a blouse and charged me the $2 for it. So this I didn't really buy so much for brand. I just bought it for the cute novelty of it. And I don't even know what these are on it. I think they're candies. It's called Pretty Good. But look how, it, I think they're like little wrapped candies. I just thought it was so cute. It's a sheer blouse, cute style. So I grabbed it for $2. This is J. Jill, it's just a linen cardigan. J. Jill has been doing pretty darn well for me lately. So I grab it if I see it, especially for $2. Um, 
Bob Mackie has also been selling for me. This isn't the plus size, which I usually sell, but it's extra large and it's got little green roses all over it or flowers of some sort. It's just a cardigan with three four sleeve, three quarter sleeves. It's Bob Mackie wearable art, $2. I thought this Lucky Brand shirt was adorable. Size extra large, good size. It's like, um, let's see here. Where's the blouse? Like, here's the arms. Like, this is layered, but the arms are sheer. So this has a sheer with a layer under it, underneath it. And roughly, very pretty from Lucky Brand. And this is Rosin Alley. I just bought it because it's plus size. It's 3X, and it was $2. It's a nice material. And this is the dress I was talking to you about. It is the Ralph Lauren Denim Thin Supply, and it's this little, you know, boho, peasanty dress. So that's it. That is everything I got today. Not that much. But like I said, I still have two buckets to do. I don't know what I'm going to get to tonight. I know I still have to ship, and I don't know. So... Um, and then tomorrow, my friend who has just gotten into eBay wants to go somewhere to source. I don't get to hang out with her very often, so I guess I'm going to go. Don't know where yet. So we'll see. See you guys tomorrow. Remember, I'm Melissa. You're watching Florida on Dime. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know you're listening.